making automated tablet coding systems since 1986. And uh, clearly it's been a long time and no matter how much we think we've become ex experts, there's always something new we learn because a tablet coder is a process equipment, which means it's a very fine balancing of various parameters and variables. And that only time can teach you. Um, there's no profound insight you can get ex except one you gain by experience. And that's why we feel I would they say quite immodestly that we do build the best batch processing tablet coater in the world. And uh, we don't necessarily provide or state an improvement unless it's backed by tangible results. Uh, it's not based on some abstract concepts or claim, it's based by real performance. And I think we've been more sensitized to today's need. There are so many peer group vendors talking about the speed of the machine and so on. But what we focus on is ensuring a, a, a predictable result every day, every hour, 24 hours. And we also embrace technologies as and when they come. We've received an immense amount of support from various vendors like our nozzle vendor or automation vendor. So we believe that in the future we will arguably have the first AI equipped tablet coding system in the world. Well, one of the things we've done is when we got deeper into the subject of tablet coating, we realized that a lot of the design features is based on an, on an experience which has not been worked backwards towards confirming the same with academic and research studies. So we did work with India's Technological Institute to validate the results we're getting and also model the pan of the future. And I'm quite pleased to tell you that we're there. <coughs> we should be getting our design registrations done and we expect by the start of 2024, we'll arguably able to speed up the process, primarily because the needs from a tablet coder have evolved. Today, there are more and more applications going towards functional coating, drug layering, and so on, which we believe the tablet coder, GANS coder for the 2024 onwards will be able to rise up to. Automation, for instance, um, everybody is aware or sensitized to the fact about electronic record keeping, primarily the general advisory from the US FDA 21, 20 CFR 11. But I think we are going well beyond that to seeing as how the tablet quota and its data recording systems and collection systems segue into a level two and level three management information system. And we are quite happy to have identified a vendor whom we can work with, who has a ne necessary wherewithals to get us up to that system where it fits, segues very smoothly into a larger architecture of manufacturing, where quality of product and risk management for avoiding any problems with quality and output are assured.